Hello everybody, Isaac, the bee man here. Jose is one of my bee guys for 20 years here and I've asked him to stay behind so we can take this beehive apart and show you what is on the inside. This is a smoker. We put smoke on them not to make them go away because if they went away, I would be a pretty stupid beekeeper. Pretty soon, I'd have no more bees. This makes them think their house is burning so they're not thinking of stinging me. That's why we use this. We put this on the top like this. We go to the front of the entrance. This here, why is this black? At one time, this was all white. Why is this black? It's because so many bees have gone in and out of that slot. That's their front door. Again, they've gone in and out of there that it has turned this black. We're gonna take out one of these frames and see what's going on in here. This is the wrong size frame for this box. The bees made all of this wax on the bottom of the frame and they have babies. These are all their babies. There is nothing in these cells. There is honey here. Do you see that? There is honey. This is babies. This side is babies right there. There is babies down here. Jose, hold this for me. Let's put some more smoke on them. This here, Jose, hold that frame over here. Put it next, next to it. No, bring it to me. Hold it next to it. This is the correct size frame right here. This one is not correct. Here, let's see, Jose. Uh, hold, Jose, hold here. Let me see. Do you see, oh, he went behind. You see this bee here? He has pollen on his legs. Do you see him? Right there. They eat pollen and honey. These are all babies. All of these are babies. There is honey here. You want to see? Here. Mmm, delicious. You see the honey? These are babies right next to it. Hold this, Jose. Hold this. This is all babies right here. And here is the queen, Jose. Jose, yeah, Jose, hold this. Hold the corner. She's here. I just saw the queen. I just saw her, she was right here. Let me see if she's on the back. I don't see her now. She was right there. Do you see the queen? She was right there. Yeah. Here is the queen. She's going on the other side. She's right here. Let's find her and show her on camera. So here. Here she is. Watch. Do you see that? Here she is. She is double the size of the workers, all of these are her babies. She lays 1,000 eggs per day to keep the hive afloat. She is a young queen because she's orange in color. You see the color? Now, I would love to see if I see any boy bees here. Let me have this. You can put that one back, Jose, in here. Put it right there as the first one. This is another frame. Oh yeah, there is honey. 
There is honey here. There is nothing here. They make their honeycomb out of a hex pattern cell. They make a cell, it's hexagon. And they use this for laying their eggs and uh, making honey and collecting pollen. You probably ask yourself, why is some of this honey black honeycomb? This is white and this is black. The reason is the queen bee has laid eggs in these and then the worker bees clean the cell and they put honey inside. These here have pollen in them. Do you see the pollen? It's yellow in color. Do you see it all? It's right there, right there, right there. This is pollen. Now, if I touch the bees, they're gonna sting me, but because I don't touch them, I let them touch me. They don't sting me. Jose, hold this right here. Let me see here. Let me see if I can get these bees on my hand. Hold on. Here, watch. So remember that lesson? I let them touch me. I don't touch them. If I touch them, they're gonna sting. You have probably never seen what I'm gonna show you right now in reference to the bees. Do you know what this is? I'm sure you don't know what this is. This is what's called a swarm trap. What they do, they make a paper, like a bucket like that, upside down, and they put a pheromone inside a queen's pheromone inside, and if there is any families of bees in the area, uh, they will be attracted to this box here. I have never used these things, but pest control companies set these things up in on people's properties, and then when the bees move in, the customers call me and say, come and get them. You cannot harvest honey from something like this. Uh, so, unfortunately, these bees are really a waste. That's why I let them live here, uh, just live here, make honey for themselves. I don't harvest anything. Uh, again, these are swarm traps. They're made out of paper. The whole can is, and they put a pheromone inside. I'm gonna smoke them, and let's see what they do. Do you see the top here? They have filled the inside with honey and wax so they can raise babies and eat the honey and live. And this is full. They are starting to come out of the top. You can see their honeycomb coming out here. They have, they have eaten a hole on the side of this can. This is made out of paper. They have eaten a hole and you can see their honeycomb inside. Do you see how black that honeycomb is? When they first made that honeycomb, that honeycomb was the color of snow, white.
When the queen bee lays eggs in it, generation after generation after generation, it turns black. They clean it and it's still good wax, but yet the color is not white anymore. This is newer than this. Do you see the difference? And yes, they have a queen. I've never seen her, but I know she's there because they stay here. And they've been here probably a year. Once you smoke them, once you smoke them, they're safe if you want to move them. I'm going to pick them up. If I was going to transport these, I could now without any protection because I smoked them. This is the top when we want to close them. We put this here. That's all I have for you today. I'm sure you'll be at the next lesson. Bye-bye. Okay, let's bring this.